everybody and welcome. George Lawmaker arrested during protest of governor signing voting reform bill. Yeah, a Democrat, a Democrat representative in Atlanta, Georgia named Park Cannon was involved in a protest with a bunch of people and they were protesting this new reform bill that is basically going to make our elections a little bit more honest and prevent any voter fraud, especially in Georgia since, you know, the 2020 election, Biden won by 12,000 votes and they think it was a little bit corrupted and uh, there hasn't been a Democrat that's won in Georgia in 30 years and they're trying to pass these voting reforms that everybody thinks un-American. It's all un-American. I mean, is it really? I mean, you don't want honest elections. What are we going to do? We're going to let the whole world start in voting in our elections? I mean, let's let, let's let China, yeah, let China and let them vote in the election. Shoot. Next thing you know, we'll have like Chiang Kai-shek as our next president. So basically, this woman was uh, beating on the governor's door. I don't know how she got in there, but she was in the protest and like, oh, let's go beat on the door and we'll get this bill, you know, right away. Cancel culture at its best. So don't get your way. Start acting like a little third grader. And she went up to the governor's door while he was in a video conference and starts beating on the door. Yeah, beat on a bunch of times. State troopers came in and they told her to stop and she continued. And they arrested her and brought her up on charges. Yeah. So, I mean, what, what do you think you're going to accomplish with that? I mean, what is this? So, she was arrested brought up on charges of obstruction and disrupting a general assembly session. And she was taken to the Fulton County Jail. And so her protesters were all shouting release, you know, Miss Cannon. And of course, that didn't do anything. But she got released around 1130. And they all walked her to her car and said, we stand by you. Well, you could have probably stood by her in that jail as long as you wanted to, man. I'm sure there's plenty of room in that cell. So she was booked in and released. And the penalties are up from one to five years in prison if she uh, gets convicted. So basically this is what's going on in Georgia, man. They passed this bill to prevent voter fraud. So another Democrat representative is talking about this bill and says that the uh, legis legislation was triggered by Republican circulated lies last November. So everybody was lying saying there's no voter fraud. And she's, her name is uh, Rhonda Bernot. She's a Democrat, of course. I mean, what did you think? And she said Georgia was one of the key states that the Trump campaign fo focused on and honed in on unfounded claims of voter fraud during the 2020 election. So during this news conference on Friday, so here comes Biden on the news conference on Friday, and he talks about how this voting bill makes Jim Crow look like Jim Eagle, whatever that means, and it's un-America, un-American. And it says it's sick, and this is gigantic what they're trying to do, and, uh, you know, Biden, man. So, anyway, this uh, Georgia lawmaker got arrested. Way to go. And that's, uh, I mean, <laughs> look at that. I mean, we've gone from talking to debating. Now we're getting physical, okay? A lot of yelling and screaming and beating on doors, and it's just kind of silly. So, anyway. That's what's going on today, people. I do appreciate you watching. If you would hit that like and subscribe, I sure would appreciate it. Take care.